everybody, ladies and gentlemen. Again, let us welcome to our uh, live uh, worship and devotion at St. Gertrude the Great Devotional Center here in Kalawag, Quezon. To all my viewers who are uh, watching from different places, again, I am welcome you to this uh, holy hour of worship to give glory to God and devote ourselves to Him throughout this day. To those who are watching from different places, from home, from the hospital, from any places, my dear brothers and sisters, this is our time to give glory to God and devote ourselves to Him throughout this day. It is now uh, in eating here in the Philippines. To all the viewers who are always patronizing, the, uh, participating in our uh, glory and uh, in our uh, devotion to give glory to God, I am welcome you to our uh, very meaningful devotion. Before we uh, proceed to our devotion, ladies and gentlemen, I have a lot of song that I want to share to everybody as part of our spiritual uh, activity, worship in order to please God and to give our uh, brothers and sisters a very inspiring song that could uh, make them happy and enjoy and have a tranquility of mind. My dear brothers and sisters, our uh, beloved Sinjur to the Great is welcome, uh, is uh, willing to accommodate you at this uh, very beautiful uh, moment. Ikaw is the first song by our beloved John Ray Umana.
Mama. This is a birthday song. Okay, this is another song. Ikaw. Another song. Tanging kay Jesus. Mulang matatagpuan. Okay, another song. Brother, brothers and sisters. Our uh, Let us surrender ourselves to God in all our worries at this uh, very beautiful uh, day to give glory to God. Our beloved Senior to the Great is uh, accommodating thousands souls every day. To those who have uh, problems, worries, again and again, Every day, every night, in every minute, let us uh, have worship and entrust God to our uh, problems in our lives.
Another song with their brothers and sisters. Yeah. Mm -hmm. 
Okay, another song. It's our prayer today. With our brothers and sisters. Again, I will welcome you at this very beautiful uh, moment with God to give glory for His goodness and majesty. Okay, another song. Ikapalang kagurangnan. Uyan na sa mga kamu. Labi pa sa kaipuhan Sa irarunin buo Meaning, you are the God of God. Okay, another song, Ang Tanging Alay Ko. Okay, this is a very nice song. My dear brothers and sisters, uh, this is the time for us to give praise to God and uh, take a rest for a moment to uh, give worship to Him for all the, the beauty, for all the uh, blessings that we have received. The beauty of His uh, creation. Another song, Ang Tanging Alay 
Mexico. I just want to uh, give you a very beautiful uh, words of God, thoughts of wisdom uh, coming from Psalms. Th uh, Psalms uh, 41. Thanksgiving after sickness. Happy is who has regard for the lowly in the poor. In the day of misfortune, the Lord will deliver him. The Lord will keep and preserve him. He will make him happy on the earth. And not give him over to the will of his enemies. The Lord will help him on his sick bed. He will take away all his ailment when he is ill. Once I said, O oh Lord, have pity on me. Heal me. Though I have sinned against you, my enemies see the wars of me. When we will die, his, his name perish. When one comes to see me, he speaks without sincerity. His heart stirs up. Malice when he lives, he gives voice to its outside. My, uh, all my foes whisper together against me. Against me, they imagine the wars. The malignant disease with his frame. And now he lies ill, he will not rise again. Even my friend who had my trust and partook of my bread has raised his heel against me. But you, O Lord, have pity on me and raise up that I may repeat, repay them that you love me I know my, by this that my enemy does not triumph over me but because of my integrity you sustain me let me stand before you forever blessed be the Lord the God of Israel from all eternity and forever Amen this is a very nice uh, Words of wisdom, a thanksgiving after sickness, under uh, Psalm 41. Proceed to our formal solemn prayer. To those who are watching from different places, from home and from uh, Dubai, Saudi Arabia, America, England, and of course to all our viewers who are watching from Luzon, Visayas, and Mindanao, you are so welcome. I am uh, delighted to welcome you in our live stream, Songs of Worship. Let us give glory to God for all His blessings that we are, uh, we are, uh, that we have received. With this uh, devotion, we will be able to help our uh, brothers and sisters who are in need of our prayers and petition. Magintong niloko ang aking dalangin O Diyos ay tanggapin ang tanging alay ko naway gamitin Ito lamang ang song wala nang iba pa ako'y Wala nang iba pa Ako'y hinihiling Okay, another song! Another song, ladies and gentlemen! Wait, 
Show me where to go. Hiram ng buhay ko by uh, Janwe Umana. Okay, another song. If you struggle to lose weight, you must see this. A fact dissolving loophole has just. Sa Damasco naman ay may isang alagad na ang pangalan Ananyas. Ginawag siya ng Panginoon sa isang pangitain. Ananyas, ano po iyon, Panginoon? Tugon niya. Pumunta ka sa kali matuwid sa bahay ni Judas at ipagtanong mo ang isang lalaking tagatarso na pangalan Saulo. Sabi ng Panginoon, siya'y nananalangin ngayon sa isang pangitain. Nakita ka niya at pumasok sa kinaroonan niya at pinatunguhan mo siya ng kamay Pinatungan mo siya ng kamay upang makakita. Sumagot si Anias, Panginoon, marami na po akong 
nakita akin tungkol sa akin tungkol sa taong ito ngunit tungkol sa mga kasamaang ginawa niya sa inyong banal sa Jerusalem at naparito siya sa Damasco taglay ang kapangyarihan galing sa mga punong saserdote upang dakpin ang lahat ng tumatawag sa inyong pangalan ngunit sinabi sa kanila ng Panginoon kumaroon ka sapagkat hinirang ka hinirang ko siyang ipakilala ang aking pangalan sa mga hintin sa mga hari at sa mga anak ng Israel at ipapaalam ko sa kanya ang lahat ng dapat niyang tiisin alang-alang sa akin pumunta nga si Ananias Pumunta siya sa bahay at ipinatong ang kanyang kamay kay sa, sa ulo. Kapatid na sa ulo, wika niya. Pinapapunta ako rito ng Panginoong Hesus na nagpakita sa iyo sa daan, sa daan ng ikaw ay pumunta rito. Sinugo niya ako upang muli kong makakita at mapuspos na Espiritu Santo. Pagkadakay, may naglala, may naglaglag, may nagla... Pagdakay may nalaglag na tela, mga kaliskis mula sa mga mata ni Saulo, at nakakita na siya. Tumindig siya agad, at nagpabinyag, kumain siya, at naulila ang kanyang lakas. Si Saulo, ilang araw, nakasama ang mga alagad sa Damasco, pumasok siya sa mga sinaguga at nangaral tungkol kay Jesus. Siya ang anak ng Diyos. Wika niya. Mga kapatid, ito ang salita ng Diyos. A very beautiful words of God tungkol sa ating uh, mahal na Panginoon ng mga apostol na kung saan nung mga araw na yon, laging matindi ang pagnanay sa Saulo na usigin at patayin ang mga alagad ng ating Panginoon. My dear brothers and sisters, we hear from the word of God and let us reflect what is the uh, essence of this uh, words of God in our lives in a in our lives a very beautiful uh, words of wisdom coming from uh, Gawa chapter 9 verses 1 to 20 eternal love May you I love and cherish in joy and pure delight, pure delight. Let us offer our intention to our brothers and sisters who are uh, serving the, uh, to all the teachers who are serving the Comelec, volunteers, and the uh, Comelec uh, election on uh, Monday. It has asked God to bless our brothers and sisters, the voters, the candidates, and uh, to have a successful election next week. It has uh, offered our intention to God and ask for the guidance of the Holy Spirit to bless our brothers and sisters who are serving the uh, uh, homile, the uh, election. Pure delight. Okay, another song. Abi Maria. Okay, another song. Abi Maria. Wind, show me where to go. 
May our beloved Reverend Father Maximiliano Meridi. After uh, 30 minutes, ladies and gentlemen, uh, we will uh, formally proceed to our uh, solemnly hour of prayer. Let us uh, offer this uh, song to everybody who are uh, watching. Oh. Uh,
Hello brothers and sisters, another song. Awit ng paghangat.
Another song with your brothers and sisters, Pagsibo. By our beloved, Noel Cabango. It has included our uh, intention, the health of the condition of uh, our uh, beloved holiness for Francis. And of course, it has also included our intention, the uh, protections of our beloved cardinals, bishops, priests, religious, seminarians, nuns, lay missionary who are serving the church. And their brothers and sisters, Pagsibol. Jesus, simulan ng buhay, puso'y dalisay, kailan pa man ipahintulot mo, ako'y mapahandusan sa suma sa iba yung aking hawa. My dear brothers and sisters, let us offer our intention to God, especially to our brothers and sisters who are uh, assisting the incoming election to our brothers and sisters, to all the uh, voters that God give us uh, light and wisdom to choose who will be the qualified leaders in our country. Let us also offer our intention for the successful election. Noong ikaw ang kasibulan ng buhay puso'y dalisay kailan pa Dear brothers and sisters, this is a very nice song, Pagsibo. If you hear, if you hear the song, you will feel the essence of God, the presence of God in our lives. The Holy Spirit will enter in our hearts and uh, give us strength, a sound of mind, and a healthy body. Pagmamahal Panginoon Ikaw Ang kasimula Ng buhay Puso'y dalisay Kailan pa man Ipahintulot mo Ako'y mapahal Sana'y mapagtantunay Kaganapan ng buhay ko'y ikaw lamang A very nice song, my dear brothers and sisters Okay, another song, Jesus ng aking buhay. If you struggle to lose weight, you must see this. Hindi. Uh, sa'yo lamang. I'm here in the biggest trading floor located in the front of the Another song, sa'yo lamang, tanging yaman. Coming from Himig, Iswita. Sun! 
Okay, so, sa iyo lamang, tanging nyama. Uwi ang takot sa akin. My dear brothers and sisters, let us uh, prepare ourselves to God. As a business, a we want to make your customers feel special with great customer service. As we but start our uh, solemn prayer.
sisters. It has uh, put our sister back. It has offered our sister in face of God and asked for the guidance of the Holy Spirit at this uh, very beautiful uh, moment. It has uh, mentioned our uh, intention, personal intention to Him, to our, uh, let us also offer our intention first and foremost to our beloved Holiness Pope Francis. Let us also include our intention to our brothers and sisters who are uh, suffering due to of, uh, violence, hatred, tragedy, war, and conflict, especially to the people of Ukraine and uh, Russia and all over the world. Not only here in the Philippines, somewhere in uh, abroad, in any places. Let us also offer our intention to our brothers and sisters who are working from any agency that God continue to give them strength to persevere over trials and to help to sustain their needs. Let us also offer our intention our uh, brothers and sisters who are uh, losing their hope. My dear brothers and sisters, let us formally start our solemn prayer. In the name of the Father, and the Son, of the Holy Spirit, Amen. God, who God may expect to save us. Oh Lord, make haste to help us. In the resurrection of Christ, that heaven and earth rejoice. Hallelujah. In the resurrection of Christ, that heaven and earth rejoice. Hallelujah. Oh, blessed are you, sovereign Lord, the God, the Father of our Lord Jesus Christ. To you be the glory and praise forever. On the deep waters of death, you brought your people to a new birth by raising your Son to life in triumph. Through him, dark death has been destroyed, and when yet radiant light is everywhere restored us, as you call us in the darkness of this marvelous night, may our lives reflect his glory, and our lips repeat the endless song. Blessed be God, Father, and Son, Holy Spirit, blessed be God forever, Amen. He choirs of you, Jerusalem, your sweetness. Pascal victory of him, this train of holy joy, how Judah lions burst his kings, and crushed the serpents his head, brought with him from death domains, the long imprisoned dead. Time found his glory now, his scepter, all the earth, the earth, heaven, and hell before him, all his personal fall, while joyful does his praise we sing, his mercy with glory. Into his place, fight to drink and keep us evermore. Oh, glory to the Father, be of glory to the Son, of oh, glory to the Holy Ghost to be by endless ages. Run, hallelujah, amen. That this evening may be holy, and good, and peaceful. Let us pray with one heart and mind as our evening prayer rises. You, o Lord, O God, to may your mercy come down upon us to clean our hearts and set us free to sing your praises. And now forever, Amen. In the day of my trouble, I have sought the Lord. 
I cry aloud to God. I cry aloud to God and He will hear me. In the day of my trouble, I have sought the Lord. By night my hand is stretched out and does not tire my soul refuses to work. I think upon God and I groan. I ponder in my spirit pains. You will not let my eyelids close. I am so troubled that I cannot speak. I consider the days of old. I remember the years long past. I communion with my heart in the night. My spirit searches for understanding. Will the Lord cast out of offer forever? Will be no longer more to us His favor? Has His loving mercy been gone forever? Has His promise come to an end forever? Has God forgotten to be precious? He has shut up His compassion, His displeasure. And I said, my grief is this, that the right hand is the most high, has lost His strength. I will uh, meditate on all your works and ponder your mighty deeds. Your way of God is holy. I is great of God as our God. You are the God who work wonders and declare your power among the people. With a mighty arm you redeem your people. The children of Jacob and Joseph. The waters saw you, O God. The waters you saw you and were afraid. The days over also were troubled. The clouds poured out water, and the sky thundered. Your arrows flashed on every side. The voice of your thunder was in the whirlwind. Your lightnings it lit up the ground. The earth trembled and shook. You may wash in the sea, and your past the great waters. But your footsteps were not known. You led your people like sheep. By the hand of Moses and Aaron, in the day of my trouble, I have sought the Lord. God, our shepherd, you let us save us in times of old. Do not forget your people and their troubles, but raise up your power to sustain the poor and helpless. For the honor of Jesus Christ, our Lord, glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, will be forever. Amen. Brothers and sisters, let us hear the uh, word of God taken from the book of Deuteronomy, chapter 7, verses 12. ordinances by diligently serving them the Lord your God will maintain with you the covenant loyalty that he source to your ancestors he will love you bless you and multiply you he will bless the foot of your womb and the foot of your ground your grain and your wine and your oil the increase of your cattle in the issue of your flock, in the land is sore to your ancestors to give you. You shall be the most blessed of peoples, will neither sterility nor baritness among you on livestock. The Lord will turn away from you every illness, all the dread diseases of Egypt that you experience 
He will not inflict you, but He will lay down them on who hate you. You shall devour all the peoples that the Lord your God is giving over to you, showing them no pity. You shall not serve their gods, for that would be a snare to you. If you say to yourself, These nations are more numerous than I. How can I dispose them? Do not be afraid of them. Just remember that the Lord your God did to Pharaoh and all the Egypt. The great trials that your eyes saw, the signs and wonders, the mighty hand in the outstretched arm, By which the Lord, your God, brought you out. The Lord, your God, will be saved to all the peoples of whom you are afraid. Moreover, the Lord, your God, will send the pestilence. O some God, the Lord, your God, will clear away the peace nation before you little by little. You will not be able to make a quick end of them. Otherwise, The wild animals would become too numerous for you, but the Lord your God will give them over and to them and to great panic until you have destroyed them. The images of their gods you shall burn with fire. Do not covet the silver of the gold that is on them and take it to yourself because you could be stared for it. Uh, a foreign to the Lord your God. Do not bring an abhorrent thing into your house, and you will be set apart for destruction like it. You must utterly detest and abhor it, for it is set apart for destruction. My dear brothers and sisters, the word of the Lord.
brothers and sisters, let us hear the readings taken up from the uh, letter of work of the Ephesians, chapter 3, verses 1 to 13. This is the reason from the Holy Gospel according to the uh, from the uh, Saint Paul to the Ephesians. This is the reason I call out a prisoner of Christ Jesus for the sake of your Gentiles. For your surely you have already heard of the permission of God's graces that was given to me for you. And now the mystery was made known to me by revelation as I wrote about in a few words a reading of which enable you to perceive the understanding of the mystery of Christ empowerment generation this mystery was not uh, made known to humankind and is now revealed to his holy apostles and prophets by the spirit that is the Gentiles have become fellow heirs members of the same body and shares in the promise in Christ Jesus through the gospel of this gospel I have become a servant according to the gift of God's grace that was given to me by working of his power although I am the very least of the saints this grace was given to me to bring the dead Gentiles to the news of the boundless riches of Christ and to make everyone what is the plan of the mystery hidden for ages in God who created all things that through the church the wisdom of God and which variety might now to be made known to the rulers and the authority in the heavenly places this was in accordance with the eternal purpose that he has carried out in Christ Jesus our Lord in whom you have access to God in boundless confidence to faith in Him. I pray therefore that you may not lose part over my suffering for you. We are your glory. Amen. My dear brothers and sisters, this is the Holy Gospel. Praise uh, to you, Lord Jesus Christ. The Lord is my strength and my song. He has become my salvation. The Lord is my strength and my song. He has become my salvation. He shall not die, but live and declare the works of the Lord. He has become my salvation. Glory to the Father and to the Son the Holy Spirit. The Lord is my salvation and my song. He has become my salvation. He has fed the hungry with good things and he sent away empty. He has cast down the ill of his servant as well to remember his promise of mercy, the promise he made to our fathers, and to remember his holy covenant. Oh, Casting down the mighty from their thrones and lifting up the lowly. He has filled the hungry with good things and sent away empty. He has come to the head of his servant Israel 
The remember is promise of mercy. You see, the promise made to our ancestors to Abraham is drifted forever. Amen. Glory to the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and be forever. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and be forever. Amen. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayers. Almighty Father, who in your great mercy gladdened the disciples with the sight of the risen Lord, give us such knowledge of his presence with us. That we may strengthen and sustain by his risen life and serve you continually in righteousness and truth. Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, our Lord, who is alive and raised with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. Amen. Father in heaven, hallowed be your name, your kingdom come. You will be done on earth as in heaven. Give us today our daily bread. Forgive us our sins as we forgive those who sins against us. Let us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory of yours, now and forever. Amen. Rejoicing in God's new creation. Let us pray with confidence as our Savior has taught us. May the risen Christ grant us the joy of eternal life. Amen. Let us bless the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. In the name of the Father, the Son, of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Brothers and sisters, our solemn night of prayer is already ended. Let us also include our, in our devotion. another as Christ loves his church. We ask you to bless all parents with the love and cherish and children whom God has entrusted to them. May they always give them the example of truly Christian life. Help them to bring us their children in the love and fear of God. Bless our children that they may love, honor, and obey their fathers and mothers to your love, care, especially in trust the youth of your today. Give us all sense of responsibility that we may do our part in making our home a heaven of peace. Like on home at Nazareth, we take you as our model. Help us to go daily in our genuine love of God, neighbor so that justice and peace may happily reign in the entire family of mankind. Amen. Holy Mary, pray for us. Holy Virgin, conceived without sin, pray for us. Our Mother of Perpetual Help, pray for us. We sinners call to you, loving Mother, help us.
at, uh, at the setting of the sun to you and feeding light I turn I thank you for the day now feeding I pray you give me an evening of quiet to my spirit and you let me rest that I may know refreshment of soul and peace of heart one place is still attentive to you alone let my soul pray Holy Spirit no one no other breath than you Amen in a stillness in a silence deep as night be my soul before you Holy Spirit come down upon me sub as the starlight close around me closer than the dark repress me and renew me as you fall in rain will renew the earth stay with me Lord until the morning comes in the dawning of the new day be to you an ever brighter sunburst in my soul Amen Prayer to the Holy Spirit Come Holy Spirit fill the hearts of your faithful Enkindle in them the fire of your love. Send forth your Holy Spirit, and they shall be created, and you shall renew the face of the earth. O God, who teach us the hearts of your faithful by the light of the Holy Spirit, grant us by the same Spirit to have right judgment in all things and forever to rejoice in His holy comfort. Through Christ our Lord. Amen. Come, Holy Spirit, upon the church to and enlighten it, that it may work effectively for the salvation of all the peoples. Come, Holy Spirit, come, Holy Spirit, give counsel and wisdom to our Holy Father, the Pope, and to all the bishops for the governing of your people. Come, Holy Spirit, come, Holy Spirit. Give to your people the outpouring of your grace. This console and enlighten all of whom have been given. Come, Holy Spirit. Come, Holy Spirit. Bless our hearts in all in will and fill us with the love towards all our all come. Come, Holy Spirit, and with your light enlighten those who govern us that they may say what is right. In your strength, perform it. Come, Holy Spirit. Come, Holy Spirit. Bond of unity and peace. And hasten the unity of all peoples in Christ. Take from our midst the scars of war and terrorism. And from our hearts the cause of war and terrorism. Come, Holy Spirit. Come, Holy Spirit. Descend upon all who have been baptized into Christ. Break down the barriers with divide, strengthen the bonds, unite, and make all the faithful in love. Come, Holy Spirit. Come, Holy Spirit, in your kindness. Heal the sick and receive the dying. Counsel the doubtful. Console the despairing. Let all our hearts come to rest in you. Come, Holy Spirit. Teach me. Oh, Holy Spirit, my light. Love, life, my strength. Be with me now and always. It is all my doubts, perplexes, and trials. Come, Holy Spirit, in our loneliness, weariness, and grief. Come, Holy Spirit, and failure in His loss and disappointment. Come, Holy Spirit, when others fail me, when others fail myself. Come, Holy Spirit. When I am ill, unable to work, I pray, come Holy Spirit, now and forever in all things, come Holy Spirit. Oh, bless me now, my Savior, I come to you. Let us pray for the sick, especially for, uh, from the hospital. Christ, you born our suffering, carried our sorrows, 
in order to show us clearly the value of human witness and patience. Graciously hear us our prayers for the sick, especially my our uh, my dear brothers and sisters, my friends, come to who are weighted down with pain and other affliction of illness, may realize that they are among the chosen one whom you can bless it, help them to understand that they are united with you and your suffering for the salvation of the world. Amen. Let us raise our voice. Let us raise our voice to proclaim our faith. Christ the Lord for us has died, dying. He destroyed our death, rising. He restored our life to Lord Jesus. We await your love return in glory. When we eat the bread, when we drink the cup, and the blessed Eucharist, we meet you, our risen Savior, giving life to us, a new life journey. Be with us, present us forever. Amen. You have given the bread from heaven. Hallelujah. The source of all happiness. Hallelujah. Lord God, with the Paschal mystery of death and resurrection of your only Son, you accomplish the work of man's redemption. All of us will proclaim the Paschal mystery in the sacrament signs of Eucharist. Help us to say our growing up the fruits of your saving work through Christ our Lord. Amen. Blessed be God, let us, uh, let us pray. Blessed be God, blessed be His holy name. Blessed be Jesus Christ, through God and through man. Blessed be the name of Jesus. Blessed be His holy, most sacred heart. Blessed be His most precious blood. Blessed be Jesus in the most holy sacrament of the altar. Blessed be the Holy Spirit, the Paraclete. Blessed be the Great Mother of God, Mary Most Holy. Blessed be the Holy Immaculate Conception. Blessed be Glorious Assumption. Blessed be the name of Mary, Virgin of Mother. Blessed be Saint Joseph, her most chaste spouse. Blessed be God and His angels and His saints. We believe, dear Mother of God, that you are extremely kind and generous to all your loving and devoted children. We plead with you, therefore, dear Mother, to obtain for us the help we so urgently need. We are trying so earnestly to solve our problems, but we believe in your powerful intercession with our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, and our Redeemer. Amen. Mary, my mother, you love for us. You could not be greater or more powerful. You are rich in love and your power brings us relief. You want everyone to be saved. I beg you, therefore, protect me in temptation and strengthen me. When I weaken, I struggle daily to be faithful to Jesus, your son. Help me, my mother, at every moment. But above all, take me my hand when you, when you see that I am weakening about of all, I will have to battle with the temptation till the day of my, I die. My lady, you are my hope, my refuse, my strength. Never let me 
lost the grace of God and every temptation, I resolved to turn you at once and pray. Mary, help me. Amen. In the name of the Father, the Son, of the Holy Spirit. Amen. My dear brothers and sisters, thank you so much for the time that you have extended to me. Even though you are not uh, in the live stream, I offer you all my prayers and petition, and I do believe that God is always with you. May the Lord bless you and your family. Amen. Thank you so much. I would like to send my uh, heart with gratitude. First and foremost, to our beloved Holiness Pope Francis and to all the viewers who are watching right now. Good evening.